Hey guys, it's Jason, and today I'm here to talk about Namecoin. Now, Namecoin has a really awesome idea. Now, if you want to know, Namecoin is actually the number four cryptocurrency, and it basically is the last, you know, the lowest cryptocurrency that's still in the tier three type of coin. And honestly, I'm skeptical, skeptical to invest in it. And here's why. You know, people are asked, and this is why I, I present the question. People have been emailing me and asking me, you know, Nova Coin seems like it's up there. You know, it seems like it's a very popular coin. Should I invest in it? And again, I refrain from trying to give financial advice because, I mean, yeah, it's not my money at risk. But I'm going to try to bring in facts. So, Nova Coin has a great development team, somewhat, <laughs> and they have a great concept. The problem with Nova Coin that I see is most people that get into cryptocurrencies, be that, you know, Litecoin, Peercoin, Primecoin, is that they're looking into it more as an investment than for the concept. You know, a lot of people say, oh yeah, it's great that, you know, there are there will be, you know, 84 million Litecoins. But most people don't care. Or, yeah, it's really interesting that, you know, Peercoin uses less energy than Bitcoin. But people aren't putting their money in it because of that. They're putting their money in it because they think that it has a potential to succeed and to make them a profit. The problem with Namecoin is while it's a great concept, the whole idea of Namecoin is a peer-to-peer -peer way to pay for a domain name system. And I believe that the, it's not .bit. And I, I've talked about before, I'm fascinated by such an idea. The fear I have is that it is being speculated, it is being broadly invested by people that normally invest in Litecoin, Peercoin, Feathercoin, coins that really are only designed to be a currency versus a coin that is designed to be a peer-to-peer -peer domain system as well as a currency integrated into that domain name system. I'm not saying, you know, get rid of all your name coins. I'm just saying, you know, as the price increases, as it's getting more popular, you know, as the market cap is getting higher, I warn you, before you invest more and more money into a coin, look into it and figure out personally, do you feel that the, the way the coin was developed, the structure in which it's designed to operate, is that a concept that you're willing to put your money into? You know, a lot of people now are starting to look, you know, and this is, this is what scares me. People will email me and saying, well, hey, I'm cashing out, you know, $5,000 on my 401k to invest in, you know, Bitcoin. What cryptocurrency should I invest in? That scares me. Not because I don't think these cryptocurrencies and Bitcoin will succeed. I do. My fear is people have, saying, oh, man, I have all this money. I'm going to throw it out the wall and try to make as much money as I can. And I don't want that. I want people to look at it as a ability to learn to promote cryptocurrencies, but also realize only, you know, only invest money that you're willing to lose. You know, I've heard this argument people go against all the time that when you put money into Bitcoin, assume that all that money is just going to disappear. You know, if you put money in the stock market, assume all that money is just going to disappear. And if you do make a profit, that's great. But if you don't, you're not out everything. You know, you're not putting, you're not taking a mortgage out on your house to invest into Bitcoin. That's all I'm saying. You know, Namecoin is a great coin. It's a great concept. You know, the concept is being developed. The domain name system, you know, peer-to-peer -peer connections and the software to use to buy those have gotten better and better. It's they're in the process of developing a GUI for it. But and that stands for graphic user interface, I believe. Like an easier way for the, an average user to you know use the software. But it just scares me that it's being speculated and invested at like a normal cryptocurrency coin. Anyway, have a great day. Thanks for watching my video, and I hope you make some sound financial advice.